Hi everyone, it's Tamara here and today in this video we are going to be showing you how to do your middle splits. So we're going to be breaking down a few stretches that we do at the studio here to get your beautiful middle splits. All right, dancers, make sure you are warmed up from class or exercising before you do any kind of stretching to make sure those muscles are nice and warm. Let's go ahead and bring those feet together, standing up nice and tall. We're gonna roll down with our heads all the way down into that pike stretch forward. Palms flat on the floor. If you can take your fingers backwards and get those palms flat, that's even better. And plie bend and straighten ankles together. Plie bend, try to keep those palms flat on the floor. Plie bend and stretch, plie bend and stretch. Slowly roll it up, six, seven. We're gonna open into second position. We're gonna bring it down into this stretch right here so we can open up those hips, stretch our groin muscles. You can shift side to side, hold it there. Come on and turn it parallel, stretch it forward, hands onto the floor. Shift that weight forward in your toes. And slowly roll it up, nice. We're gonna come onto our stomachs. We're gonna lie down flat on our stomachs. We're gonna bring our feet together in our diamonds. We're just gonna open up our hips in this position for a few seconds. So obviously if we're doing middle splits, it's a lot of hip, hip work and hip mobility, joint mobility. So. Go ahead and lie in this position for a little while. Your goal is to eventually have your hips flat on the floor and your feet flat on the floor, but if they're not, that's okay too. What you ideally wanna do is keep your hips on the floor and let your feet naturally start to drop lower and lower with time and practice. Good, go ahead and open up the feet into our frog stretch. So we're gonna open up our knees in line with our hips and keep them bent just like this. So you should have your hips and then knees in the same straight line. So we're dipping into that groin a little bit deeper. And slowly roll it up. Push back onto our knees. Perfect, let's go ahead and sit onto our bums. Open up into our straddles. So obviously make sure that you are warmed up and stretched before diving directly into middle splits. So we're not gonna walk through our, our entire straddle series. We're gonna walk those hands forward and just stretch it all the way down into this flat straddle stretch. Hold it there for 10, nine, eight, seven, six. Oh, we're getting a foot stretch. Five, four, three, two, and one. Roll it up nice and tall. We're gonna come onto our knees. Go ahead and place those hands on our hips, sitting up nice and tall. Perfect. From here, place those hands onto the floor. Go ahead and Tom, do that right leg out to the side. So what we're going to do is make sure that this foot that you have tondued out to the side is in line with your hips. Okay, so what's naturally natural is that everybody's going to kind of put their toe here. Make sure it's going directly in line with those hips. From there, we're gonna slide that foot out to the floor. So we're going onto our elbows as much as you can. So we are stretching one side of this middle split, yeah? So we should be forward, Ada. Move your elbows forward. Scoot, 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 more. Scoot, scoot, scoot. Your, your knee is not in line with your hips. This knee isn't there. That's where we wanna go, stretch, squeeze it. Same thing, look at this, uh-oh. That's a no-no, okay? Get up. This knee should be in line with your hips. Open your leg. There we go. Nope, see how you're, you keep this knee in line with your hips there. There we go. So this is like a single leg middle split. And you can swing that leg around or you can push back up, whatever works for you guys. Come back onto our knees. Hands in front of us, left leg is now going to go out. Make sure that toe's in line with your hips. Make sure this knee stays in line with your hips as you sink it down into that other side. There it is. Squeeze that leg, hold it there. And then we've got Miss Flat Sarah over here, perfect. Who's very turned out and open-hipped. She's lucky. Hold it there. Good, Valerie, much better. 
and slowly bring it up. Perfect. So the next step to getting your middle splits, um, we're going to go ahead and lie down onto our backs, place our heads towards the mirror, feet towards me. Both legs up to the ceiling, open into the straddles this way. And we're going to hold it here for 10, 9, please feel free to hold these stretches longer than what we are doing in this video, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, arms out to the side, bring those legs up to the ceiling. We're going to beat, beat, and open, and a beat, beat, and open, arms out to the side, beat, beat, and open, beat, beat, and open, beat, beat, and open, toes on the floor, go, straddle, there we go, squeeze your legs, energy in your toes, oh my goodness, and a beat, beat, open, beat, beat, open, hold it there, grab those feet, stretch those knees please, make sure they're straight, squeeze your low bum while you're there, don't forget you still need to be using your glutes, and slowly relax, good, all right, most important thing, when you're about to do your middle split, let's go ahead and stand up. We're gonna actually start our middle split, a full middle split, up against the wall. Why? Because you're gonna use your sit bones to stabilize your body while you slide down into that position. So we're gonna have the dancers come up against the wall, put your booties all the way there, open up into second position. Okay, hands are gonna go onto the floor in front of you. Okay, while you keep your sit bones on the, on the wall, pressing backwards, go ahead and start to slide into that middle split. So this is going to help your dancers and you dancers watching this video, keep your alignment in your middle split. So if you start here, now it's like, oh, it's easy to keep your hips in line with your knees in line with your toes because you're using the wall. So hold it there. And then you can also find out what you need to work on, meaning see, Ada needs to work on stretching the backs of those ligaments in her knees so that she can get really straight legs. So we're gonna stay right there, Valerie, yep. And drop down onto your elbows, mm-hmm. Keep your toes forward, yep, that's it. That's your middle split. We're gonna keep, put your heels there. Heels on the wall. There we go. And we're gonna work on getting those knees nice and straight. Oh my goodness, point those toes, Mila. And shake it out. <laughs> Good job, Ada. All right, let's come out to the center. Let's put you guys to the test. Let's try those middle splits. Here we go. Ready in the middle. Hands onto the floor. Slide it down into those middle splits. Let's see, are, is our alignment better? Do we feel like we can go a little further? Are those knees nice and squeezed? There we go. Hold it for 10, nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, all right, let's stand up. That wraps up how to get those middle splits for you guys. I hope you guys learned some tips and tricks. If you like our videos, please make sure to subscribe to our channel and we will see you guys all next time. Thank you.